we talk about some smart equipment. I got myself some smart plugs. So, if you've never heard, seen these or heard of these, basically they're basically plugs that you plug in and basically they're controlled by Wi Fi. Great. So, this is a TPC Smart. It works with Alexa. And I think it works, oh yeah, it works with Alexa and Amazon and Apple. Cool. So, basically, if you have a, something you want to turn on with a like, remote or a schedule, this would be good for you. So let's open it up. So you don't get much packaging. Okay. Wow. You don't get much. It seems a waste of packaging. For the box, for the plug, it's kind of pointless, but that's okay. So, we'll get this set up now. Okay, it's, it's off. Cool. Alright, I presume download the app. So you can get the app pretty much, I presume, um, Apple and Android, so go ahead. I've never done this before, so this is going to be my first way of doing this, so uh, give me a second, go to my app store, you won't see all this. Search for TCP Smart, here we go. Manual. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's what I should have done in the first place. That's a nice QR code here. Right, I'm in. So we basically sign up. I basically this is a policy, so no worry about that. We'll see this. So basically, the Senate called to your email address. Set a password. Uh, what do for now? Um, do I want to know? No, I don't want any of this analytics. I don't want them to. Uh, okay, only what I'm using. So basically, <laughs> that was all blurriness. Basically, the, I got it. So you basically add. Now we find the power TP link. Um, okay, so another thing that's blur. 
Not a blowing today, but that's okay. I don't know it by heart. So basically you hold the power button on the on the thing until it goes yellow. That seems easy enough. Yeah, I can turn it blinking rapidly. Now it's basically talking to device and controlling signals. Arc device. Okay, I'm back now. Yeah, that's all been plugged into the into the thing. That, that took a while. So basically, um, oh, there's a new firmware as well. So we'll update that now. Update. Okay, so that's now been. Updated, so that's good. So basically, the firmware says right. There's a new update on it. So what is updated? So that's good. This is good practice to have. So basically, we can turn it on and off. Oh, why is that not? On and off on my phone rapidly, which is quite good. Now, what other things does this thing have without giving up too much away? So basically, it has that. Um, I think I just question. So basically you can have a scheduler, so you can have like, basically the schedule means that like you can either set a time and day when you have it on, so basically if you like go at home at night and you can leave the eyes on, that's quite good. Timer, so you can like leave it on for like a minute, which is good, so basically you can rename it from the top right, good. Um, what I want to know is... Uh, So you can basically set up the Alexa service, that's good. Management home, home. You can add other devices too, that's good. But what I want to know is... Account and security is as well, looking for. Also, you can lock it, that's good. You can link on mobile to it. I presume there's a two phase, hopefully, the two phase application. So, yeah, this is exactly what I need, and I'll get busy setting this So You won't see all that, but basically, this is just a quick setup on how the smart plug works. And you can add way more to this than what I'm actually sure. Just more things I need to add to my smart home app because every app has a security plan. So, not all, not all smart plugs have their own. Devices, but this is good to know. So I hope this entice you to buy a smart plug. This where you find this, where you'll find a description, where you'll find this in the description. Now, if you want to, if you are one of these egghead people who think, oh, the government listened to you, it's just a smart plug. It's, there's not really any data they will have, really. So, I don't think they're going to show you. And basically, your phone basically will cause everything. So, you have Siri, you've got Google, you've got Amazon. All the devices, they say they don't listen, but I think they do. But you don't live bold lives. People don't want your data. You live bold lives. What they want is your information, how to clone you. But that's a different topic. So, what I'll do is, I'll see you in the next video, and I'll say goodbye.